The, uh, obviously, the last time I did the Giro was 2010, and I've progressed a hell of a lot as a rider since then. And that Giro was basically uh, I struggled to survive. Even I just about got to the finish line, and it was uh, it was probably one of the hardest races uh, I've ever done. But it's it's also an experience that that really helped me progress as a rider, and both, both psychologically and physically. And yeah, after after finishing that race and getting a lot of rest, I, I went on to win Poland. So it's, uh, but yeah, I've got very, even though it's such a tough experience, it's it's an amazing race. It's a beautiful race and 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 the passion of the people on the side of the road and just the, the whole character of the race is one that suits me. I've I've always raced well in Italy. I've obviously done, got good results in Lombardia and, and what, a few of the one day races. So. Yeah, I'm really excited to be going back to the Giro, and I'm not really sure what to expect. It's uh, obviously, I think me and Ryder are going to be going there as as kind of joint team leaders. So we'll, uh, yeah, it's it's 21, 21 one day races again. You know, it's what I said at the tour last year, and a lot can happen over three weeks. And last year, yeah, I went, got the stage at the tour, and then my GC fell apart with three days before Paris. So. Yeah, the same can always happen again, but for sure, I'm, at this moment in time, I'd, I'd really like to to be able to get up in the general classification. But for me, yeah, to, to win a stage would be would, would really be a big, make the race a big success. But the, yeah, the general classification, it's the top ten in a Grand Tour is the one thing that's missing from my Palmares at the moment, and it's it's really I, I saw at the Tour de France last year that I really have the capacity to be able to achieve that, and uh, and yeah, hopefully. Hopefully this Giro will be the to be where, where it happens. But how far into that top ten I, I can go? I'm not really sure. That depends on the other guys, you know. And I don't even know who those other guys are at the moment. So we'll uh, I'll have to wait for the start line in Belfast and then take it day by day. And then we'll uh, yeah, it's gonna be an exciting month in May to to find out where we're at.